Hello my loving kids I am again back with an interesting lesson So welcome back to my channel the learning hub Pompa Majumdar Today we are going to learn a very exciting lesson in math It's all about odd and even numbers Children through this lesson you'll be able to identify odd and even numbers very well and your counting skills and number sense will be improved as well so children before starting the class let's have some fun so now we are going to enjoy a beautiful rhyme on odd and even numbers so are you all ready so children listen very carefully and sing the song along with ma'am even numbers even numbers shout them out 2 4 6 8 10 line them up by twos and then twos and then all the events have a friend 2 4 6 8 10 all the events have a friend odd numbers odd numbers shout them out shout them out 1 3 5 7 9 when you try to group by twos when you try to group by twos there is an extra you can't use you can't use 1 3 5 7 9 odd man out odd man out no friend in line no friend in line so children 2 4 6 8 10 are even numbers even means equal in number or value and 1 3 5 7 9 are odd numbers odd means different so what are even numbers even numbers are the numbers that can be divided into two equal parts and it also divided by two evenly without remainder even numbers can be grouped into pairs it means everyone has a partner the so children divide means split into parts and pair means a set of two things there are two shoes so we have to say this is a pair of shoes pair of earrings so pair means a set of two things so every even number has a partner now look here there is one box one box is not a pair now look here there are two boxes two boxes together make a pair because pair means a set of two things now next there are three boxes are they in pair no because we know that a set of two things make a pair these two boxes make a pair but one box is left so it has no partner so we can't put number 3 in a pair now next there are four boxes here we will get two pairs of boxes one pair and another pair so there is no leftover everyone has a partner so children there are some numbers that can be put in pairs and there are some numbers that cannot be put in pairs so all the numbers that can be paired are called 
even numbers and all the numbers that cannot be paired are called odd numbers so what are even numbers let's recall one more time the numbers that can be divided into two equal parts it is also divisible by 2 means divided by 2 evenly without remainder and can be grouped into pairs are called even numbers 2 4 6 8 10 etc are even numbers for example i have 6 chocolates 1 2 3 4 5 6 first of all we need to check how many pairs are there one pair two pairs and three pairs so there are three set of pairs nothing is left everyone has a partner so number six is an even number now i want to share these chocolates to my best friend equally this one is for me and this one is for my best friend let's divide nothing is left wow we both got three chocolates each so all the chocolates are divided equally so six is an even number one more example there are 10 stones now we need to check how many pairs are there one pair two pairs three pairs four pairs and five pairs so there are five pairs nothing is left everyone has a partner so number 10 is an even number now these stones can be divided into two groups one two three four five one two three four five so each having five stones so all the stones are divided into two equal groups so number 10 is an even number so children how do we identify the even numbers for that we need to remember few key points first even numbers can be grouped into pairs means everyone has a partner second even numbers can be divided into two equal parts third point even numbers are divisible by two without remainder fourth point is all the numbers ending with zero two four six eight are even number let me explain elaborately all the numbers that have zero two four six eight in the ones place means at the rightmost digit are even numbers so it is clear that no matter how big the number is or how many digits it has just we need to check one's place digit of a number no need to worry about the other digits got it like 38 the rightmost digit or one's place digit is 8 and 8 is an even number so 38 is an even number in the same way 20 42 86 154 etc these are all even numbers because these numbers ending with 0 2 4 6 now odd numbers 
What are odd numbers? Odd numbers are the numbers that cannot be divided by 2 evenly. It cannot be divided into two equal parts. If we divide an odd number by 2, then it will leave a remainder. And odd numbers cannot be grouped into pairs. For example, 1, 3, 5, 7, 9 are odd numbers. Look at the book. There is one box. It has no partner. And there are three boxes. Here, one pair is there, but this box has no partner. So, we can't put number 1 and 3 into a pair because we know that pair means a set of two things, but there are no pairs here. And number 1 and 3 cannot be divided into two equal parts. So, number 1 and 3 are odd numbers. Now children, look here. There are 9 dears. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Now first of all, we need to check how many pairs are there. 1 pair, 2 pairs, 3 pairs and 4 pairs. 1 is left. It has no partner. So number 9 is an odd number. Now let's try to divide 9 dears between two friends, Annie and Samita. Hey, they are friends. She is Annie and she is Samita. So let's divide 9 dears between these two friends. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. They have got four each. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. But there is one more left. So we could not divide nine years equally into two groups. So number nine is not an even number. Number nine is an odd number. Children, how do we identify the odd numbers? For that, we need to remember a few key points. First, odd numbers cannot be grouped into pairs. Means, everyone doesn't have a partner. Second, odd numbers cannot be divided into two equal parts. Third, Odd numbers are not evenly divisible by 2. Fourth one is all the numbers ending with 1, 3, 5, 7, 9 are odd numbers. It means all the numbers that have 1, 3, 5, 7, 9 in the ones place are odd numbers. For example, 17. This number is ending with 7. 7 is an odd number. So, number 17 is an odd number. In the same way, 21, 33, 49, 95, 247, etc. These are all odd numbers because these numbers ending with 1, 3, 9, 5, 7. Children, look here. One more key point is after every even number, there is an odd number. And after every odd number, there is an even number. Look here. Odd, even, odd, even, odd, even, and so on. Number 1 is odd, 2 is even. 3 is odd, 4 is even, 5 is odd, 6 is even, 7 is odd, 8 is even, 9 is odd and 10 is even and so on. So odd and even numbers come one after the other. 
Now children, let's do an interesting activity. This is a calendar and there are 30 or 31 days in a month. This is November month and it has 30 days. Now we are going to identify odd and even numbers of this month. The easiest way to identify an even or odd number is by looking at the last digit or the rightmost digit. So let's start. All the numbers that ends with 0, 2, 4, 6, 8, 8 are even numbers. These are all even numbers. So even numbers always ends with 0, 2, 4, 6, 8. Now let's identify the odd numbers. All the numbers that have 1, 3, 5, 7 or 9 in the ones place are odd number. Let's see. 1, 3, 5, 7, 9, These are all odd numbers. So odd numbers always ends with 1, 3, 5, 7, 9. Yay! We did a great job. Hope you had a great time learning about odd and even numbers. And if you think the video is helpful for you, then don't forget to like and subscribe the channel. Bye-bye.